Welcome to Mudding with Beegs, episode 15. Today we're going to go to, let's see, Boston, Massachusetts, 1906, Tremont Street, looking south, King's Chapel and Tremont Temple. First thing that jumps off the page at me is that, yeah, you know, we've got these humongous monstrosities on either side of the road. Just amazing architecture. I mean, just, just stupefyingly beautiful yet we can't pave the damn road now if you do two plus two it equals four right well if you add you know the ability to build these buildings in these styles in this time 1906 or earlier because you know these buildings are older it you know two plus two don't equal four when it comes to the ability to pave a road you can't lay some cobble down. You can't figure out how to make asphalt. You can't do something other than this. I mean, look at that. What is that? Well, we got potholes back then. How about that? I feel a little better now. Anyways, wrought iron. That's old world. I have a, a feeling that wrought iron, this, this iron work here, had something to do with free energy also. Just a thought. I think these represent the Taurus, the Corinthian columns. That looks Phoenician like a wave. Let's see what we got up here. Oh, look at that. Wow, a big old cat. It's like a, I wonder if that's like a female lion. And here's a, a lion here. That's interesting, a female lion. Could be a jaguar too, I'm not sure. These are called finals. Calum told me that these are called finals the other day. And he's right. And I did not know that. So I learned something. Anyways, that's pretty cool, huh? So I think these were free energy antennas here, this business up here. I forgot to wipe this one clean. Looks like a P. Kind of looks like another P, I'm not sure, and a D. Got your pyramid uh, here, symbology. Pyramid here. Looks like a cartouche has been wiped. Yeah, that'd be like a Tartarian lion. Got a flower symbol there. Oh, that's interesting. Whatever that be that is right there wiped cartouche right there see all this is facade if you get down underneath the meat of this thing is a it's a brick building i'd love to there's a shell so that would be phoenician that looks like a whale now that screams phoenician to me just a thought let's see what else we got street lamp street lamps are so cool back then i mean they're free energy but i mean they're still like they put like D design and art into their fixtures it's really cool yeah so so you're going to use this wagon right here and this wagon right here to bring all this shit in to build all this okay do the math two plus two does not equal four in this case okay this sorry ass cart and horse not putting down horses because i'm sure this is a mighty fine horse but that sorry sap sucker ain't gonna build this building. I'm sorry. And there's this poor sap right here. Or this guy. Or this guy. Now this guy knows what's going on. Look at him. He's probably he, he's looking, he's looking at the mud flood. He's like, boy, that winter indoor is below ground. I know it is. I ain't stupid. That's what he's saying to himself. <laughs> Anyways, moving on. Got a clock. Cl clocks are expensive. Just saying. Antenna. Bringing in for here. Good lord, look at the detail on that thing. God, what the hell going on right there? That looks like a damn portal. I don't know, starts, uh, Stargate. <laughs> an antenna up here. That's not a flagpole, people. Yes, we hang flags on them because we're dumbasses. That's free energy equipment right there. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's back up. Uh, what we got here? Oh. That's uh, coho, coho, coho. 
that would come up here and pour the coal in here and there all this is hollow I can't tell for sure but that could be pavement light right there and that could be pavement light right there can't confirm that 100% but what I can confirm is that's a Tartarian line and that's a Tartarian line right there and then you got a pyramid here and I see a pyramid here and that would be as above so below or so below as above and you got a Florida Lee here and you got this flower symbology here which I think means something I don't know what I think it's important so when you see that perk up pay attention let's see good gracious look oh god this is the detail in this thing damn in 1906 they had this I mean man they're one step away from being cave people and yet they can build this my ass see there's your brick all this is facade man brick 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 who's making all the bricks if you study bricks there ain't a Chinaman's chance in hell of us being able to produce enough bricks to build these buildings in the time frame with the manufacturing capabilities of the time to build these buildings. If you study it, if you look into it, it's not possible. Two plus two don't equal four. It equals 50 bajillion. Okay, that's what it equals. This is two plus two equals 50 bajillion. That's what this is. Look at that spire there. That's that's almost uh um almost kind of Moorish in a way, but it's it's not. I don't think that just kind of reminds me of it. And we had these crappy awnings. These crappy awnings because we were hot. See, it wasn't as hot when they built these buildings. It, the the temperature was basically perfect. They didn't have the temperature problems we have now. We don't. They didn't have the government controlling the weather like we do now. Oh, we didn't know that. Look into it. Pretty obvious, people. Okay. Anyways, moving on. What else we got? We got Milwaukee, the Paps Building, 1901. So this is where they make the beer. Well, they don't make it here, but that's the. We got a canal. Canals are old world. In case you ain't figured that out yet. Ooh, what we got here? That would be an eight point asterisk. What does that mean? It's the vertical here. The vertical line symbolizes the north and the south. The flat line symbolizes the flat earth. And the X represents the torus field. And that's my opinion. And I'm sticking to it. Got your Tartarian line on the bridge here. This is probably technology here. Probably part of the free energy in some way. We don't know how it all works. There's a lot of questions. We are trying to figure it out. Look at that dragon right there. Good grief. Ooh wee. Some sort of symbology on these buildings here. I can't see it. Let's see. We're selling life insurance. Looks like wall. All bullshit. Man, look at that. That kind of looks Phoenician in a way. Hard to see though. Oh, good gracious. God. What in the world? Look at the tech on that thing. Man, they're sucking some juice out of air right there. Man. Got a clock. Clocks are expensive. Boy, like a, a, a cupola up here. Cupolas are part of the free energy. That kind of looks like a Florida Lee, but I'm not sure. It could be a double-headed eagle, uh, i.e. a uh, phoenix. I don't know. Hard to tell. Um, man, that's another clock. Boy, that boy, they, mm, we didn't build the shit. We ain't built this, people. Come on. You know that. If you're watching this, you already know. You already know. We're just looking at it together. We're just looking at it and enjoying the the old world together because i tell you what if you listen to this you already know look at that there's something going on with that that's all free energy antennas right there all that all that all saying all intense all sucking the juice out of air all that sucking that juice out of air getting that etheric air and just <laughs> sucking it up good free stuff good free pure energy 
pure energy. Do, 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 do. You ever heard that song? That's a good song. I might should use that for something. Let's see what else we got. Uh, e -A -E -A -E -A, Indianapolis, 1905, Federal Building, Courthouse, and Post Office, Ohio Street. Post Post Office. Post Office. You at your damn mind. You call it as a post office. Got an eagle on a ball. That's a world symbology. That ain't no flagpole, people. Anybody's ever hung a flag, okay, ever, and left it up knows you can't leave a flag up that they just tear right up. Flags do not go on poles and stay up there. Look at these old world tech lights, old free energy lights. Look at that. Oh, wow. Good gracious. I wonder who she is. She's probably the grand poobah of the Tartarians or something. I don't know. United States courthouse and post office erected. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we got to <laughs> Y'all ain't gonna believe we built this shit, so we're gonna write it right on the big old front, so you see, because we know you ain't that dumb. God. Man. God, what? A uh, post office? Kiss my ass. Look at these winners. Now, that see right there, that'd be grading, and so that goes below ground right there. That That is below ground. That's that's shining light in there. Can't really see it too good, but look at the door frame of that sucker. Look at this little fella. This wee little man right here, and he's got this big old door right here. Good gracious! I wonder who that is. Who's she supposed to be? Lady Justice sitting on her ass? I don't know. Lady Justice. She Justice is blind, people. I mean, this fella, he gonna trot up and he gonna build that sack, that damn thing right there. This fella right here is gonna ride up on his horse and save the day and build that building. Because he's the man. Oh, Lord. Ah, there you go. There's your mud flood. See? Boom. Down the hole. See, it's almost like they, 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 they hide it as well as they can, but then they, they just can't get around certain things, and they have to show it to you. They're like, damn, we got to show them here. Oh, well, maybe they won't notice. Man, we didn't notice for a long time. Man, look at the detail. Is that stained glass? Holy cracky. Doggone. Man, look at that. Ooh-wee, that's pretty. I love these high-resolution images. They are just phenomenal. I mean, look at that thing. God, okay, got to move on. I spent all day looking at that. What else we got? Oh, okay, San Francisco, looking up Post Street from Kearney in the aftermath of the April 18th, 1906 earthquake and fire. Okay, so first off, that's not an earthquake. Second off, yeah, it might have been a fire, but it was called by a, caused by a dew weapon, okay? Directed energy weapon, okay? And what they do is they use scalar technology, and they 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 basically uh, 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 it it structure it, it 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 messes with the molecules, okay, and it basically just ex it dis disintegrates them. I mean, a good example is on 9/11. That's how they took down the towers. They dustified them. They 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 scalar weaponed them. And, and they destroyed the buildings. If you go back and look and watch the videos, you'll see a seven foot, 100 foot tower of iron, iron structural iron, iron, 700 feet of structural iron, okay, I beams sitting straight up in the air after, after the building collapsed, okay? One of the buildings comes down, there's 700 feet of, of I beams sticking straight up in the air, and just as soon as you see it, the damn thing turns to dust in the middle of the air and disintegrates right in front of your eyes. Okay, now I'm sorry, people, but that is not possible in the old reality of what we used to know was possible. Okay, that's next level, whole nother realm shit. Okay, well, they use the same technology here. Might have been used in a different way. It might have been a, a different style of weapon, but this is a do weapon attack. They did the same thing in California recently. They do it all over the world. They do it all the time. These crazy ass fires that burn houses but not trees and, and completely take 
the houses apart. Have you ever seen a house fire where a house burns literally to the ground? Ever? Brick and all? I mean, come on. Stupid. See all these bricks? It looks like it's not brick. I mean, stand back. It, it doesn't look like it's brick, but it is brick. Brick. All this is brick. Everything's brick, 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 brick. And they had steel back then, people. Okay. So, so the, it, we didn't invent this. Okay. Steel. This is old world too. Okay. We didn't invent steel. They invented steel back in the old world. Okay. Got your diamond symbology. That looks like a Phoenician head. Yep, there's your Tartarian lions. Not hard to find them these days. Look at the brickwork there. That's incredible. Very detailed keystone. Some sort of symbol there. Not sure what's going on there. And, you know, it's interesting. These, these buildings are hard as just... You wouldn't believe how hard. Look at the detail on that. Look just right there. What in the world have they built there? That looks like a pine cone. That would be symbology. There's a free antenna right there. Free energy antenna. Blah blah blah. Though, if you took, if you take, and you can watch videos on this where where they take uh, looks like scrub cartouches there. Man, look at that thing. The detail is just incredible. How they did this. Oh. We, if we could only build like this, I tell you, we'd be something else. They, they, if you take a, a wrecking ball to one of these Tartarian buildings, the dang wrecking ball will bounce off. They are so freaking well made. A wrecking ball. I mean, boom. They can't get them to knock down. They, 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 they have to. They have to use explosives. They, they can't, and, and, and then you look at the, the, the buildings being taken down, supposedly in like the Civil War, and they say, oh, the cannonball shot them out. No, they didn't. How are you going to get a little tiny cannonball to go and destroy a building when you can't even get a big-ass construction demolition ball? You know, uh, I'm thinking of uh, Miley Cyrus on that damn ball for some reason. And just, you're going to run Miley Cyrus on the ball into a Tartarian building? Bitch going to fall off. That's all that's going to happen. That's what I'm saying. This poor sap soaker's like, how in the hell am I going to cover this mess up? I can tell you what, because I know this place is mud flooded. Good grief. I mean, look at the brick. This ain't earthquake, people. Yeah, this ain't an uh, earthquake. Don't do this. And they say, oh, it's, it's, it's just poor construction. Does that look like poor construction to you? People, look at look inside this thing. It is solid as a rock. Okay, that is a freaking mountain. That is good construction. Okay, we couldn't knock this shit down today. An earthquake did not do this. It, it, it's just, it, it didn't happen that way. Moving on. <sighs> New York, 1905. Oh boy, my buddy J.P. Morgan. What a, hmm, insert curse word. 23 Wall Street and Broad, Drexel building, eclipsed by its gilded tenant. Okay, so it's talking about this. Good God. Wow. Wow. What in the H -E double hockey stick is that? Good Christ. This, this is right here. This dripping, uh, there's your Tartarian line. It <laughs> didn't take me long to find that. Uh, it, it This dripping of uh, the flowers and stuff means something. That's interesting. It kind of looks like a shell. I don't know. It could be Phoenician. I don't know. There's some horse shit we added, I'm sure. Oh, goodness gracious. What in the heck? How in the world did people believe? There's a final. Look at that. That's an antenna. Good gracious. How in the world did people even believe? Like, you just put yourself in their shoes. You're a person from 1900, right? And you're walking around New York City, right? And you're thinking, okay, well, I'm a primitive son of a bitch. Because I know, you know, I live in this time and I'm a primitive son of a bitch. Okay? I ain't got no electricity. I ain't, I drive a horse and cart. I got, you know, 
a shitty life. I, I, I don't have good food, blah, blah, blah. On and on and on and on and on, okay? But you're going to sit there and believe that you built this, okay? You can build this, but you got to drive that and that and that. Oh, he knows. There's boss man right there. That's boss man. I knew I'd find him. Oh, well, I don't know. That might be that might be boss man junior right there. And that's boss man training. Okay. Anyways, moving on. God, I mean, seriously, put yourself in their their shoes. You you have to know. You have to imagine that they they just it cognitive dissonance is the only thing I can say. Th this is total double think. You know that you can't build this shit, yet you believe that you can. You have to, because it's in front of you, it's built, and everybody says, we built it. So you use cognitive dissonance. Look at the size of that door. Okay, look at this little fellow right here. Ah, little, let's say he's six foot tall with the hat. And that's good 12 foot door, I'd say. No, not 12 foot, maybe 10 foot door. And that is... Hold on, hold on, hold on, back up, back up. Okay, six foot, let me think. That's probably 10 foot door. That's probably 15 feet. That's probably 20, that's probably a good 20 foot door frame. That's the door frame. Okay. I don't know. I, w I don't know. That's a big, that, we didn't build this. And then look at your mud flood down here. And we got something going there. I can't get a good look at it though. Shoot. I can't tell. Oh well. Anyways, I mean, think about this for a second. Look at this building. Okay, we're going to put windows, supposedly, quote unquote, big old air quotes. Okay, we're playing air quotes today. Okay, we're going to air quote that we're going to build windows and we're going to put them below, at ground level and below. And then we're going to go, well, let's put big ass bars on them because, well, we're not stupid. You know, we don't want people to break in our building. Instead of putting the windows higher, like here, see how these are high? Why not put them higher so that people can't break in your building? And then you have big old ugly, ugly iron bars on your building. Look at the stairs going down. There's a coal hole cover there. Good gravy. Man, this is not our world, man. We have barred this shit from somebody. Look at that. Oh, man. Oh, gone. There's a free energy light. Wow. Hello, free energy. I miss you. Drexel building. There's your pyramid. Oh, man, y'all. These things are just incredible. Look at the detail. I bet they scrub these cartouches right here. There's the free energy antennas up on top of here. What we got over here? I can't tell what that. Oh, look at the detail. Oh, mighty. Oh, man. Good grief. Oh, I got to go. Oh, God. oh, Tartarian line right there. Boom. Good grief. Damn. I mean, seriously. This is 1905, people. I don't care it's New York City. They ain't no better than nobody else. They, yes, they're a huge, big old jackass city. Okay, but you know what? There's a whole bunch of big old jackass cities around, around this world. They all look exactly like this. Every one of them. Okay, every damn one of these cities. Well, who are these ladies? Hello, ladies. How are you doing today? Would you tell me the secret of Mud Flood? Because I know you know. 18873. Mm -hmm. Is that an address? Or is that a year built? I'm just saying. Just a thought. Okay, we're going to just put Tartarian lines all the way across the face here. Go make sure you know whose building this is. Damn. Man, they ain't playing. They ain't playing. Good gracious. Hello, Tartarian. Man. Good grief. Got scrubbed cartouches here. See, I think these had something on them. They're too damn plain. It, look, if you look back, they're too damn plain. Why are they so plain? I don't know. What the heck is that thing? I can't even make that out. I don't know. Portals. Pyramids. 
damn jp morgan you know he was a crooked bastard i don't know if you know who jp morgan is but study jp morgan he's he's in the, he's on the he, you know he's in the the you know the top tier of uh uh asshole of the years man you need you need to know about some jp morgan now he, he's real important to your studies of of this uh, all this mess he's 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 like hit jack ass engine he, he him and uh old rockefeller oh uh 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 all, all them people like that all them uh 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 or they called um robber barons i mean you know these people are, are are pure evil man i mean they're just straight up sucking evil out of the air they thrive on that stuff man okay moving on i think let's see philadelphia 1904 city hall clock tower from south broad street 1904 Jesus. who okay wow i mean damn let's see all these new growth trees here always have new growth trees it's something i've noticed I, they, they they never have old old trees they're always new growth planted trees there's something to that i mean look at look at the plain ass wall and then they got all this detail right here very interesting i wish i could see it better i just can't see the detail enough oh let's back up see if we can see these things are important i don't know these are something to do with the energy look at this free energy lights Gosh, this almost is a brand right here because i see these all over the world this style here that was something you could order up. Let's see. Yeah, awning. The detail in a damn awning. That uh, like a roof covered area. Man, she. Okay, moving on. Okay. Ooh, what we got here? What is that? What the hell is that? Pipes of some sort. Hmm. I don't know what they're doing. A little construction hut. Hmm. Let's get up here and see what's going on. Okay, nothing interesting. Jeez. Man. I wish this was clear. I can't see it. Ah, you. Dang, gone. Something, something going on there. I won't see that, but I can't see it look at that man god oh my goodness that free energy antenna right there all oh, that's antenna sucking up portals wow man this just takes your breath away looking at this stuff i mean really looking we take this stuff for granted we've ignored it too long Okay, we're going to put a light in the middle of the street because that makes sense. Okay, good gracious. Look at the size of that thing. God. Man, that thing is massively freaking badass. Portals. Look at that. Cool. We got pyramid. Man, antenna. Shit. Big ass clock. There's Big Ben Jr. Dang. There's your uh, eagle on a ball right there. That's old world symbology. Wow, look at that. Man. And I think I've read somewhere this sucker right here is like 15, 20 feet tall right here. Just to give you an idea of scale. That ain't no little statue, is my point. That is a massive, massive freaking statue right there. It may look small. If you look into this this statue on this, I've looked into this building before. It, it's massive. That is a big ass. Now, how you tell me how they got that there before 1904? Yeah, can't because we didn't put it there. That's what I thought. Anyways, the North American okay well all right 
That's a, you know that building's off the damn plane. Hmm. Interesting. What's going on back here? Big old uh, castle. I didn't know they had castles in Philadelphia. Let's see. Okay, let's go over here. Let's see what's going on over here. What's that right there? Man. What the heck is that thing? In the world? Oh, uh, that's wild, man. That's like a... Oh, uh, okay. So this is some sh this is some shit we added right here. See this right here? It looks like a fire escape. I don't think that's a fire escape, although it could be a fire escape. Th this... I, okay. The, I, I, uh, yes, I was about to say it's a theater. I don't know how to prove it. <laughs> Good, we got a street sign. Okay, I dumbass. Anyways, th what this is, I've seen this before. W what this is is they have the cheap seats up here, and they would bring the the cheap the cheap. You buy your cheap tickets and you come in and get in the balcony up here. So this would be the balcony entrance. Wow, look at these onion dome type things. Three energy devices on top. Man. See, we were added all this crap up here. Man, let me look up here. Let's see if there's anything. Wow. Okay, that's cool. We've got antennas. Man. Incredible. Just, it, oh. Look at that. That looks Phoenician right there. That looks Moorish to me right there. This building, this whole building looks has a Moorish style to it to me. It just is my opinion. Okay, I'm moving forward. What else we got? Oh man. And technology there, free energy lights, blah blah blah. Wow. Oh my god. Okay. Alright, now we're gonna go look at a catalog. Okay, we got a catalog architectural iron and steel and its application in the construction of buildings, including beams and girders in floor construction, rolled iron struts, wrought and cast iron columns, fireproof columns column connections, cast iron lintels, roof trusses, stairways, elevator enclosures, ornamental iron, floor lights, that's pavement lights, and skylights, vault lights, that's pavement lights, doors and shutters, window guards, grills, etc., etc., with specification of ironwork and selected papers in relation to the ironwork from a revision of the present law before the legislature affecting public interest in the city of New York in so far as the same regulates the construction of building in said city. La la la. Oh, go back. Oh, by, uh, let's see, second edition, 1892 is the year of this. So let's just take a look at this, and I will leave the link to this uh, catalog in the description and you can go take a look at it for yourself and read it because you know it's like 252 pages and if you don't read it yourself you won't learn it so if you want to learn something about this subject well here's you some reading material and i can go go uh, check it out for yourself anyways I'm going to scroll through and just let you kind of look at it. We'll talk about anything that pops up that's interesting. Looks like eye beams or something there. Let's see. D -d -d -d. I'm sure this means something to somebody. That looks pretty technical. I bring I beam diagram. Okay. Talking about loads of eye beams, I guess. La la la, Z bars. Okay. 
So this is Tom Abings. So if you're in a construction, this might be interesting to you. Uh, this isn't something I find too like fascinating. Uh, of course, I don't know a lot about it, so that's a cool picture. So I'm sure we don't build it the same way today, so it's interesting. A lot of calculations and stuff. I want to get down to the later in the catalog here. There's uh, more interesting stuff. Like, you know, the juice of cookies are in the back usually. So we're just going to scroll on through and I'm going to run my mouth. Yeah, maybe this won't take too long because this is totally French to me. And I don't speak French. I speak English. Hmm, I'm American Patriot Beagle. Ooh, okay. Now we're talking my language. Good gracious. That's what I like about these catalogs. You scroll, 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 and all of a sudden, boom. Goodies. Look at that thing. Dang. What is that? Like a goat head? Oh, what is that? Dang. Well, Florida Lee there. Corinthian column. I would say that this represents the horse field. Just my opinion. Okay. Showing how these columns connect together. Okay. That's an interesting diagram. I think it's important for us to learn as researchers of this subject how these parts fit together because if you if you understand that it makes it a lot easier to understand what you're looking at because just looking at it from a facade standpoint of ooh pretty ain't gonna cut it we need to know how the stuff is put together because it, it's a lot more complicated than we realize wow that's like Celtic looking or something. That thing's cool. Uh, dang. I, hmm. It's an interesting symbol right there. I don't know. I got a Trinity thing going there. I don't know. Interesting there. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, stairs. Ooh. Spiral stairs cases. There's your uh, see right there. You got a uh, an asterisk, uh, eight point asterisk right there. That's what symbol for flat earth, right there. I see it everywhere. Wow, ornamental ironwork. Wow, look at the detail of that thing. See, I think that represents the Taurus stuff like this, like this one right here. Wow. I mean, seriously, how how in the hell did they build that? I, I mean, that's, I don't even know. I mean, I've seen them make stuff with, with wrought iron, but I mean, that, to build it, I don't know, the detail of that, and to do it in mass, like, oh, I have no idea. That looks, I, I'm telling you, that looks like a torch field right there. I'm sorry. That matter of fact, that, to me, is an eight-point asterisk. You got your vertical. Your horizontal, and you got your X here, your torus field. I mean, I, I I think that that is a symbol for flat Earth right there. That's my opinion. Yeah, everybody's got their opinion. That's fine. I'll give you mine. You'll have a different opinion. That's okay. Everybody should have a different opinion. Because I'm probably, you know, everybody's right about something. That looks like a, a lion right there gas like my ass we, we're selling gas lights you ain't selling gas lights you're covering up free energy devices what you're doing electric light yeah okay okay let's see i think that represents the taurus florida lee taurus 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 all about taurus the Taurus was uh, very well known and very well understood, and they they showed it and they were proud of it. 
they 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 represented it um everywhere and 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 it, it, it was it was a very it, they loved their their system the system that they lived in the system of earth that they lived in you know we, we obviously don't love our earth we 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 keep killing it you know throwing trash and crap into the oceans and destroying nature and stuff like that so we obviously don't love our environment but i think they loved their environment and they they represented it like this in these artistic structural things there's pavement light right there okay there's more pavement light and moving on down moving on down what we got in here some kind of roof i think what was that thing hollow block hollow block says flat arches fireproofing columns That's odd. Huh, I don't know what that is. That's kind of weird. La 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 la, let's see. Okay. Moving on down. Anchor bolts. Some kind of gating. Oh, these are storefront gates. Okay. Moving on down. What is that thing? Oh, hey, come back here, you suckers. Platform. Oh, it's a raising and lowering platform mechanism. How about that? You could take that design and build you one. If you were so inclined. Oh, it's that's pavement light. And oh, so this is. This right here is is like pavement light, and then it has a ladder below, so you can get down into the ground. Wow. That's a coal hole cover. See, vault cover? That's a coal hole cover. Vault cover is a, a coal hole cover. Let's see. Blah, blah, blah. Rolling, rolling down, rolling down the page. Ooh. What is that? Vault lights. And the vault light. What is it? Y'all going crazy as a vault light. Damn. Look at that thing. Whew. I can see that on top of my place. Damn. That's interesting. Showing how it mounts. What that thing is. Wrought iron guard. Wow. Hey, da da da. Keep on going, keep on going. Down, down, down. Go, 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 go. Oops. Okay. So just blah, blah, blah. And I don't know what else means. It's all. Swahili to me. Like I said, I don't speak French or Spanish or Russian or German or Swahili or nothing. I speak English. I tried French once, but it didn't take. I'm sorry, I just couldn't get past the fact that we're going to learn a language, yet we're not going to use the language that you already know. I'll never forget him saying, We don't speak English in French class. Well, I don't know no French. So how the hell am I supposed to learn French? Y'all speaking all jibber jabber. So I took about a week of French class and then got out of that because that that won't gonna work for me. You won't teach me something. You got to, you got to say, well, this word is the word you know. This is the word for taco, and in French it, it is la taco zizo, some shit like that. You got to tell me this is what you know and this is what you need to know. Okay. You can't say there's a lot of tacos go and me know it's a taco. You, I mean, it's stupid. I never understood that. That's just the way my mind thinks. Uh, Jackson Architectural Iron Works. Ooh. Gee. Hey. I think that just speaks for itself. I can't add nothing to that. That's incredible. 
man, we just don't make stuff like this anymore. Not like this. I mean, if we make anything like this, it's made out of plastic or it's a mold or it's, 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 it's not, this is real stuff. This is, you know, real heavy duty stuff. At our on dines right here, it looks like what that looks like. Yep, fireplace. Yep, what I tell you, at our on dine. Okay, that's a stable, I guess. Damn, a nice ass stable. Oh boy, okay. These are ads. Oh, civil engineers. Uh huh. Illuminating tiles. So that would be sidewalk lights. Sidewalk stoops, floors. They were a big deal at one point. Study pavement light. Pavement lights are a key. There's many keys to this mud flood thing. Do not remove this car from the pocket. Well, I don't care. I will remove it, and that'll be that. Okay. Hope you enjoyed. Links are in the description. Bigs out. Wolf again! Say wolf again! I've got one that can see. This is my kung fu, and it is strong. See you later!